See, I would say I would say yes, but it's a tendency. Um, because for this to happen, the Freedom Party would have to gain 50%. Um, and I don't see any coalition partner that the Freedom Party has that would do a complete, um, even the conservatives um, have defended the Ukraine, have attacked Russia. And I don't see the Freedom Party would be simply able to, to do this on its own. But uh, the election or the success of a pro-Russian party or parties very friendly to Russia would be seen as a signal for Russia by Putin and it's another chip in the wall, absolutely. And if this continues, um, you know, this is moving towards this is moving towards uh, towards Putin. But given that the U.S. election is the much bigger, much bigger issue coming soon after the Austrian elections, um, I think the decisions that will come from that will probably override whatever we're doing in Europe. Um, but and you're probably going to have in Austria many weeks of negotiations before we see a government. So I think the US elections probably will be over before we even have a government in Austria, but the potential is there. And I think that is that is certainly a, 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 um, a likely scenario, but the Freedom Party would have to become much stronger if they really wanted to put that in, uh, would have wanted to put that in effect um, at, any, at any significant level punch. And there would be others in Austria who would be pushing back.